Oh, Tyler Murray. Dirt on me. specifically for the new linkage geometry on the new 2015. 2015 KTM did some changes to the geometry to add some more uh, shock length which changed the linkage on the bottom and spawned the new design. Uh, the older design does not fit the new 2015 uh, SX or XE bikes so we're going to go over this one a little bit. Uh, we did one little change to, uh, well a few little changes to the design. Um, we went to a four bracket, four hole bracket that clamps the um, link to the uh, link guard to the link. Um, we're using nylock nuts. We're not doing any threaded aluminum. And the other thing we're doing, and probably the biggest change, is we've gone to a UHNW uh, plastic skid plate on the bottom, which is going to help uh, basically slide over stuff easier and uh, make the guard perform a little bit better for everybody 
when they're crossing over logs and rocks. So we're going to go over a little bit real quick here and uh, show you how it's installed. So here are some of the parts in the kit and what we're going to do is first pre-assemble the link guard with the plastic skid plate and the two side plates and the hex bar. So what you need to do is mount with these bolts here, the longer M6 bolts, through these two holes and have this flat part on the front of the skid plate or side plate line up with the front of the skid plate. So we got this uh, link guard all put together. Next thing I want to show you is the clamp. And I put one of these foam strips here, but basically there's four rectangle clamp pieces. Um, these will be going on the inside with the countersink. And the countersink bolts will slide through like that. And then uh, bolt on the outside. Small round washer and a nylock nut. We have a bunch of those holding that. That's basically going to clamp the actual link so this thing doesn't move around or vibrate or anything. Um, we're going to have a piece of foam tape as part of the kit that will be installed and uh, we'll have that put. We'll have, to, uh, have to install that on all four of these pieces. So. Now that we got all of that covered, we're going to head off to the bike shop to do the install.